good morning today we will learn about the two dimensional flow in the soil and we will also derive the equation that is laplace equation consider a case a sheet sheet pile is embedded in the soil the water level this side is here and the water level this side is here since there is a pressure difference the water will seep through it from higher side to lower side suppose if we take a very small element like this if the axis along horizontal is x and along vertical is z and the if you zoom it the dimension of this element is dx along x and dz along z and if you see the three dimension if the along this length that is dy consider the velocity at inlet at for this element is vx then the velocity will be at outlet vx plus del vx by dx into dx in x direction in z direction if the velocity at inlet is vz then at the outlet point it will be vz plus del vz dz into dz and the cross sectional area in case of x axis that will be dz into dy dz into dy this one and for cross sectional area for uh, z direction that will be dx into dy so if you consider the steady steady state of flow we all know the inflow is equal to outflow discharge at inflow is equal to the discharge at outflow q inflow is equal to q is equal to v into a velocity into area so at in at in case of inlet vx into area that is dy dz dy dz and in case of uh, z direction dz dx dy and outflow so this is the velocity and this is the area so it will give the total outflow along x axis and this is total outflow along y axis if you simplify rearrange this equation you will see the the equation is rearranged like d v del dx by dx plus del dz by del z is equal to zero because this term this term this term will be cancelled only this term will be made so this this is the simplified equation after rearranging all this if you if we assume the darcy law is valid it means dx will be kx into yx along x axis similarly and this ix this ix will be delta h by delta x similarly in case of z direction that is dz is equal to kz into iz kz into iz is equal to is equal to kz into delta h by delta z if you put vx and vz from this equation to equation number suppose you can say uh, this is equation number 1 this is equation number 2 and this is equation number 3 if we put the value of vx in equation number 3 then this equation will simplify further like this x del square h by del x square plus kz del x del square h by del z is equal to 0 since we assume the soil is homogeneous if we assume the isotropic condition means property remains same here the property is permeability so kx is equal to kz is equal to k so this equation this equation will become del square h by del x square plus del square h by del z square is equal to 0 because kx is equal to k kz is equal to k it will be cancelled and this equation is called laplace equation
so thank you thanks for watching and one more thing i uh, please uh, i will request to all of you dekhiye isko video ko banane mein thodi mehnat lagti hai to agar aap log ka ek support agar raha to please video ko like kariye subscribe kijiye और कमेंट uh, अगर कुछ आप देना चाहते हैं कि वीडियो को कैसे और इम्प्रूव किया जाए तो आप इसको कमेंट भी कर सकते हैं और शेयर uh, ज़रूर कीजिए खासकर उन लोगों में जो uh, बच्चे सिविल इंजीनियरिंग कर रहे हैं या इस तरीके का कोई प्रॉब्लम में है क्योंकि ये सब चीज़ें बहुत आसानी से समझ में नहीं आती है इसीलिए क्लास के बावजूद हमने uh, फिर रिकॉर्ड भी करना शुरू किया ताकि जो बच्चों का क्लास में छूट जाए तो वो आसानी से इसको रिकवर कर सकते हैं या रिवाइज कर सकते हैं सो थैंक यू थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग। प्लीज लाइक कमेंट शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल थैंक्स ए